Welcome to online classes children. Today we will be starting a new chapter that is chapter number one large numbers and today we will be dealing with the topic Indian system of numeration. Children till the last class you have studied till six digit numbers and you know that the smallest six digit number is one lakh and the largest six digit number is 9,99,999 but here we will be studying seven digit number as well as eight digit numbers also. So when we add one to the largest six digit number we get the smallest seven digit number. You can see here when we add one to the largest six digit number we are getting the smallest seven digit number that is 10 lakh and the largest seven digit number is 99,99,999. So all the seven digit numbers uh, comes between 10 lakh till 99,99,999 including 10 lakh. So similarly when we add one to the largest seven digit number we get the smallest eight digit number that is one crore and the largest eight digit number is nine crore ninety nine nine crore ninety nine lakh ninety nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine you can see here so all the eight digit numbers uh, range from one crore till nine crore ninety nine lakh ninety nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine Coming to Indian system of numeration, uh, it is also called Hindu Arabic system of numeration. So I'll be telling you the three rows that is first one is uh, periods. So as we are studying here till uh, eight digit or nine digit numbers. So uh, the periods will be till crores period. You can see. Indian system of numeration is divided into periods. First one is one spirit, then comes thousand spirit, then lakh spirit, and then crore spirit. So uh, when we have only three digit, we will use only one spirit. Uh, why it is? Because uh, you see, one spirit has three places: ones, ones, tens, hundreds. Okay, so one spirit is having only three places, ones, tens, hundred. Thousand spirit has two places, thousands and ten thousands. So when we want four digit or five digit number, we will uh, utilize thousand spirit as well as one spirit. So till thousand spirit, we will be using for four digit and five digit number. Then comes lakh spirit. It again has two places, lakhs and ten lakhs. So when we have six digit or seven digit number, we will use lakh period. And then when we have eight digit or nine digit number, we will have crores period. It, ha it again has two places, crores and ten crores. So uh, eight digit and nine digit number will be uh, written in crores period also. So uh, you can see that uh, we are studying here periods that is one spirit then th comes thousand spirit then lakh spirit then crore spirit and then one spirit has three places thousand spirit has two places lakh spirit has two places crore spirit also has two places now if i show you the place value so one spirit has one place value ten spirit has ten place value hundred spirit has hundred thousand spirit has thousand place value 10,000 has 10,000 place value and similarly it goes on till 10 crores. So 10 crores has 10 crore as place value. So I hope it is clear. This is the Indian place value chart. So we will be studying till crores period here. So crores period, uh, crores period lakhs period, thousand period and one period then places and then place values. I hope it is clear to you. Now we'll deal with some example. So first of all, let us make 
the place value chart. So the first number you can see 62837493. So children as we want to place this number in place value chart. So we will start placing it from the right hand side. You can see uh, I have written the places in short forms like ones. I have written O here for tens. I have written T. So in that way I have written in the short form. So you can see we will place it from the right hand side. Five uh, first of all we will place in the ones period. Uh, ones period. Ones place. Okay. So five is at ones place. Three is at tens place. Nine is at hundreds place. Four is at thousands place. Seven is at ten thousands place. Then comes three at lakhs place. Eight at ten lakhs place. 2 at crores place and 6 at 10 crores place. So starting from the right hand side we will move towards the left hand side and then one by one we will be placing all these uh, values in the places. Okay so we can read this as we can see here it is a nine digit number so uh, till 10 crore we have taken this so uh, 10 crore is written uh, here you can see till 10 crore uh, the number is coming nine digit number so six and two both are at crore period so we will read it as 62 crore 83 lakh 74935 so we will read this number in that way another question you can see 1002831070 so Again, you start placing this number from the right hand side. First place 7 at 1's place, 0 at 10's place, 1's, 1 at 100's place. So in that way, you move towards the left and you will place the value in this way. Moving from the right hand side towards the left hand side. Third question you can see 89605352. 89605352. Eight, Again, you can place this value. Uh, in the place value chart starting from the right hand side and moving towards the left hand side. So first we will place 2, then 5, then 7, then 3, then 5, then 0, then 6, then 9, then 8. And we can read this number as 89 crore 60 lakhs 53,752. So in that way we are placing the numbers in the place value chart. Now use of comma. Children commas are used to separate the periods which help us recognize the number names. That means wherever the periods are changing. Suppose first period was one period and then it comes thousand period. So between one period and thousand period there will be a comma when we write the number. So in that way commas separate the periods and uh, it helps us to read the number fast and easily so i'll give you example from my practice time one question number two. First one you can see one seven three five six seven eight zero so starting from the right hand side we will place the comma here also one spirit was of three places so after three digit we will place a comma so zero eight and seven the three digits are there then we will place a comma here so then again comes thousand spirit thousand spirit is of two places so after two digit that is six and five we will place a comma after that uh, it comes black spirit black spirit is also of two digits so two places so after the two digit we will be placing comma here again and then comes crow spirit one will be at crow spirit so we will write one year simply okay so we can read this number very easily as 1 crore 73 73 lakh 56 okay so here you can see very easily we can separate the periods through the comma and we, it is very easy to read also next question you can see 9930567 so again from the right hand side as you can see that in one spirit is of 
three places and rest all the parades is of two places so uh, from the right hand side we will count first three digits so one two and three that is seven six and five so after that we'll place comma and then after each two digit we will be placing comma for the further uh, for the further wherever the periods are changing so it comes uh, 99 the, we read it as 99,30,567. Okay, 99,30,567. Now children, let us solve some more questions. So the question is, write the given number in the place value chart. So let us draw first place value chart. And the question is, 8734566. Seven, eight. So as I said, you start placing the value from the right hand side. As you can see, uh, when we have placed the comma, it is very easy to read also. This is uh, 6, 7, 8 is of 1 spirit, 4, 5 is of 1000 spirit, then 7, 3 is of lakh spirit and 8 is of crore spirit. Okay, so you can read it also, but placing the value is from the right hand side. So first place 8 at 1's place, 7 at 10's place, 6 at 100's place, 5 at 1000's place, 4 at 10,000's place, 3 at lakhs place, 7 at 10 lakhs place and 8 at crores place. So in this way from the right hand side moving, toward, moving towards the left hand side we will place the value. Second question is there you can see 7658134. And again, starting from the right hand side, move towards the left hand side and place the value in each of the places. Third question is also very similar. And the fourth one. You can see here that in all these questions, we have placed the values moving from the right hand side towards the left hand side. Okay, so children, it is very easy to place the values in a place value chart. And uh, only you think the need you need to remember is that uh, one period is of three places, and then rest of rest all the uh, periods are of two places. So uh, starting from the right hand side, you place the values and move towards the left hand side. Question number two: Insert the commas to separate the periods in the following numbers. Uh, question number. To A and C children I have already solved in uh, slide number 5 so you can note it down from there and another question that is B1 I am solving here so 554567 five, five, so starting from the right hand side as, as I said place the commas first after the three digit that is one period so uh, we will place a comma and then after each two digit we will be placing the comma first is of uh, one spirit, then thousand spirit, then lakh spirit. Okay. Second again, fifty six five six seven three zero seven one. So uh, again, starting from the right hand side, uh, place a comma after the three digit, and then after two digit again a comma will be there. Then again, after the two digit will be written because once play once tens hundred. After hundred, uh, the period is changing. And uh, thousands period is starting, so three and seven is at thousands place. So three and seven we will write, and then we'll place a comma. Then comes the lakh period, so six and five we will write. Next question is nine eight four three one six. So again in the same way, children, we will be placing the comma first, starting from the right hand side, move towards the left hand side. And in all these questions, you can see, do the same. Next is question number three, write the following numbers in words. So numbers you have to write in words. So first question is given 7986590. So you can see here, uh, two commas are there. That means uh, this is one spirit, this is thousand spirit, and this is of lakh spirit. So we will write, 79,86,590. Okay, you can read it here. 
So it is very easy and it is very fast to read when we are placing the commas. Second question is 4970162. So uh, you can see this is one spirit, this is thousand spirit and then comes lakh spirit, then comes crore spirit. So four is that crore spirit. So we will start four crore 97 lakh one 1062 children you need to note it down here that zero is written but we are not reading it so zero one is uh, one only so we write 1000 and 062 is 62 so we write 62 here yeah. so uh, zero we write but we don't read so um, take care of that when you are uh, writing the number name okay so question number c and d also you can see similarly you can uh, write the number name he is also I have I have solved all these questions from your exercise you can note it down and uh, uh, all the questions are very similar next question is write the numerals numerals means children you have to write uh, the numbers number name is given and now you have to write the numbers by placing the commas the first one you can see here 9 crore 36 lakh 79,836. So you can see 9 crore. So 9, then again a comma, then comes, then comes 36 lakh. So lakh spirit is coming. So 36, 36 we will write. Then again put a comma. Then 79,000. So in the thousand spirit we will write 7979. And then at the last 836. So 836 we will write at the one spirit. Okay. So in this way we will write. Second question 85 lakh 24,605. So first you can see lakh spirit is given here. So 85 lakh. So 85 then again we will put a comma. 85 then comma because spirit is changing. Now 24,000, 24, 24, then again 1000 spirit and so we'll place a comma. Okay, and then 605, 605. Okay, 605 will write. The third question also you can see here children. 5 crore, 22,39,852. So 5 crore, so 5 comma, then 22 lakhs, so double 2, 22 comma, 39,000, 39, comma, 852, so 852, 852. So you can see here how to place the commas and write the uh, numerals of the number names. And here is a home task for you all children. Uh, try to solve this. All the, all the questions, all these questions are from your exercise and uh, very similar questions what we have solved in the videos. So go through the video again and again and please uh, solve all the questions, all the questions of your my practice time and do complete your copy. Thank you.